Hey guys, this is Mark Blanton from The Real South Africa and welcome to the channel. If you've never been here before, of course, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and notification so you can always stay up with us. We have a great show and it's going to be full of surprises because somebody has decided to move to South Africa. And you can also purchase our book, which is online now on our website, therealsouthafrica.com. Check it out today. Hello everybody, this is Mark Edward Blanton from The Real South Africa. A lot of you guys have been following us, a lot of you guys have subscribed, but if you're watching us for the first time, go ahead and subscribe to our channel. You're going to get a lot of content. We upload weekly. Actually, we sometimes we even upload a little bit more than that. We do shorts, so you're going to get a lot of content about what's going on here in South Africa as far as being a tourist here with our company. Um, when you do subscribe, think about it. You're going to get a lot of free content too, so that's a good thing. But we also want to chronicle some of the people that actually come here with us. And, you know, without, you know, spilling the beans, because there's a video coming up after this, you know, um, we had Art and we had Jacqueline come with us many, many moons ago, about a year, year and a half ago. They came to South Africa with us um, as a, you know, because we're the tourism company, and they absolutely enjoyed themselves. And they wasn't really sure, you know, about what they were going to do. They just know they like what they seen, you know, from what we presented. They came and got exactly what they were supposed to get. They absolutely enjoyed it. And then they just decided, you know, maybe I want to live here. And so um, they came and they looked at property with us, through us. And now they're getting ready to build their, their, their dream home. Um, so we got a video for you of them breaking ground here in South Africa. So it's pretty exciting and we really appreciate the fact that they're willing to share with us and all of you guys. So share and enjoy. This is Mark Blanton with The Real South Africa. And we're coming full circle. I remember this, this couple here, the Hearts, they decided to move to South Africa. I remember when they first got off the plane. And so now, it's been about a year or so and now they're here and they bought their home and you probably hear that noise in the background. Well, that's them screaming. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is the heart, obviously. And um, yeah. What's up, man? You, you, you in South Africa? We are. We are here. Yeah. What's the deal? We're building. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's it's been a little bit of a process, but you're here. It's been a process. So what you guys see back there is they're actually we're here in South Africa, cutting their ground. Tell me about it, man. Talk, talk to him. Well, it's been a it's been a journey. Yeah, uh, but it's been a good one. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, and everything's rolling right along. So now we're breaking ground. And, yeah, uh, you know, just progressing. Uh, I'm, I'm truly excited because I never thought this day would come. <laughs> <laughs> I really did. I remember when you told me, well, I guess in one of my videos, you said you saw me going through the gate, and you like that's for me. I said, you said I was swiping my hand through the gate and then obviously you contacted us and yeah. you know you kind of followed everything that we that, that we put out right um, even through the buying process even to what we're doing right now right so it works right right it works I mean you hooked us up with a realtor they started showing us properties and, uh -huh. and we eventually ended up buying this you know piece of land yeah and then uh, everything fell in place architects you know, builders everybody came on board and yeah. And now we're doing it, and it's just a process, but it's thanks to process. the real South Africa, <laughs> yes. well, they, I, they put it in place. Well, I, I, I will say that, like I said, I know you guys have been wanting to be here for a long time, and so obviously your wife Jacqueline or Jackie, you know, she has a story as well. What do you think? I mean, like, how, 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 does, this, how does this make you feel? It makes me feel great. I'm so excited. Um, just when he came to me said, I think I said we we're gonna live in South Africa. I was like, mm -hmm. okay, I was all for it from the beginning. Especially once that was even before you visited, but especially after we visited. So like I just said, this has been a process. It's been quite the process, but it's all good. And I'm just waiting to have sit on the porch and sip my tea and <laughs> <laughs> watch the sunset. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so but then okay, like you talked about the process, you know, you you got the paperwork done. Is mm -hmm. everything is in your name? Yes. Is 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 yours? You own it. Yes. The deed. The deed. We, we own we own the land. Yeah. 
and the house will own it when the last brick is put in it mm -hmm. we'll own it as well where on a pay as you go mm -hmm. and uh, so it, yeah, that was in our favor yeah. because it allowed us to pay as we build and so we can go as fast or as slow as we want to mm -hmm. so I really enjoy the process I mean people are friendly they're nice some of them are very helpful yeah. The rest of them are just helpful. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, but, uh, you know, I can't thank my brother and sister here at all. Yes. We do what we can. We yeah. do what we can. And, uh, you know, they, I mean, Mark just, yeah, I, I watch the videos. And, you know, every time I watch them, I'm like, man, they're having too much fun over there. Yeah. <laughs> they need some friends. Yeah. <laughs> so, and it's working out. Yes. It's working yes. out. Yes. So, but but in the process, it seems everything seems legit. Everything yeah. is, yes. you know, because you get people that's like, oh, you know, that's an African, so I don't know, or it's not like you know, at home. But here, I think the process is, is very similar. Yeah. And it's, and it's, and it's above board. And you have lawyers involved, yeah, the, whole yes. the whole nine. The whole nine. Yeah. So, okay. Okay. So, so you're going to be living, like, I mean, this is, this is, this is, this is crazy. I mean, that's really, really all I can say. So, and, you know, you got a big piece of land as well. Right here on the 16th hole. Right here on the 16th hole in a, in a, in a gated community. Yes. Golf course with all the amenities. Yes. You know, and I, I think you mentioned before in other videos that it would cost you guys some more in California oh, to yeah. do the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. About 10 to 12 million. Yeah. 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 But here you can do it. Oh, yes. Okay. Okay. It's doable here. Yeah. Okay. So Jackie, so you do recommend, I'm assuming because you've got the smile on your face, that people people like us should be able to come here and have these opportunities. Yes, for sure. For sure. Yes. Okay, okay. okay. And they want to have a smile like you. Yes. And the, and the, the peace, ah. the joy, yes. The yeah. stress. That's the whole thing. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. I, I like being able to just do what I want to do when I want to do it with whoever I want to do. And this affords us that ability to do that. So I would implore all of you, if you're thinking, don't think, act. You know, if, if you guys have any spots open for that upcoming real estate thing, I would jump on it if I were you. Yes. <laughs> jump on it. Yeah, those guys are going to be set up pretty good. Cause like the same way you guys were set up, you know, you know, we put you in the, in, the, in the position to win. We set you with all the right people. Um, you know, we already knew the process because we went through it ourselves. So we knew that what, what you guys were being told was going to work for you guys. And then obviously it is. It's, it's, it's working for you guys. And so for the real estate tour, all those people that are coming, it's like 40 people that are coming, they're going to get exposed to all the same things so they can make good decisions like this. And, uh... There's a lot more plots. <laughs> you might be our neighbor. Yeah, yeah. See, and I didn't have no idea that they were going to be my neighbor. They're right up the street from, from where I'm at. That's all right. Is there anything else you want to tell people, Jackie? Is there anything you want to say? Just make those plane reservations and come on over. <laughs> okay. Come visit. Okay, and Mr. Yeah. Mr. Hart? Well, food is great. <laughs> Food is great. Matter of fact, I'm going to have some tonight. Yeah. And, uh, but I, I would call Dr. Martin and Mark and make those reservations. Let them let them set you out properly. Yeah. yeah. You can do it on your own. It's much better when they do it. Yeah. yeah. A lot yeah. less stress. Yeah. yeah. So just do it. Yeah. Yeah. Let's walk over here. Hey, this is cool, man. I know y'all been waiting for this day. Yeah. <laughs> Every day. Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. I can't believe it's happening. Yeah. I dream come true, man. Yeah, I know. Because you've been waiting, man. You've been looking at... This dude was carrying around plans. Yes. Let's talk, let's talk about that. How long you been carrying around these plans? About 15, 20, <laughs> almost 20 years. Yeah. And it was my dream home, and I wanted to build it. And uh, I was waiting on the economy to act right. Yeah. And, Good luck with that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and so it, it never did. And then this opportunity was presented to us, and mm -hmm. 
you know, so we brought them here and it was easy to do. Like yeah. A lot easier. And they were able to follow your plans pretty pretty much. Yeah, right? they, everything that I wanted is in the plan. Yes, we gave them a list of stuff. We all, we gave a list of demands. Yes. <laughs> and they made it fit with the music. Yes. Yeah. It was a little different. So it was, you know, we had a different style mm -hmm. that wouldn't fit into the community. So I just gave them carte blanche to make it fit into the community. Yeah. But we got everything we wanted. And then some. They added some things. That okay, that's I, that yeah, I, didn't even, about. I didn't even think about. It. Yeah, so, it's even better than I thought. Yeah, because uh, it's gonna be nice. I, I just I can't wait to like, just sit back and just enjoy. It. Yeah, relax, no stress. To be able to you know get up and go when you want to. Yeah. I worry about being chased by lions. <laughs> yeah, so many lions around here. Oh, Random lions. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I was believing the hype that people were telling me, you don't want to go there. Yeah. And when I got here, I got upset because I knew I had to lie to you. Yeah. And so, it wasn't a little lie either. No, it was big. Yeah. You know, it was like. I think most of the people here live better than we do there. And yeah. so, don't believe the hype. Yeah. Come see for yourself. You know, yeah. and, and it's funny you brought that up because, you know, even people contact us and they, they're only focusing on the people, you know, who are not, you know, uh, you know, doing well as they should be. That's, that's, right. that's all they want to focus on. And they want to look past some of those people that we see that are doing well just a few short years ago were um, not doing well. Right. Let's just say that. But, you know, things are moving faster for these South Africans. Right. And so these people are doing well. And the people that were doing well, when I got here, man, they're, they're out of here. Yeah. You know, yeah. they're out of here. But, you know, obviously we got a lot of those same issues in the United States, mm -hmm. but we never talk about it. We never talk about it. And the people that are here never ask us about our poverty. They never ask about all the people sleeping under bridges and, and things like that. But Americans on the street, they contact us all the time and they're like, well, what about this? But then, like you guys, you see all the grits. Yes. And so it's kind of hard to always talk about something that you don't see all the time. Right? You see this all the time. You know? So, I mean, I don't think it's a bad thing. It's not. It's not. You know, like you said, you know, there's a lot of opportunities here. And, you know, that's some people that are taking advantage of those opportunities. You know, we one of the drivers that you set us up with, yeah. you know, when we first came, he was just driving, but he wanted to start his own fleet of cars. I talked to him the other day. He's got he's got three now. And and growing. And so, you know, and I'm not talking about crazy cars. He's he on Mercedes. Yeah. You know, he's got nice cars in his fleet. And so they're moving and shaking. They have dreams and they have goals and they're achieving them. And they're achieving them faster than, no, we, ever than we ever could. And it's like, wow, it's just amazing. I wish I could have came over here 25, 30 years ago. Yeah. You know, because right after apartheid, this thing just took off. Yeah. It's, it's the Wild Wild West in a lot the of people, ways. Yeah, the people that came right after apartheid, mm -hmm. they're... They're multi-millionaires yeah. and, and growing. And, so. and you know the funny part about it is uh, a lot of people don't realize it, you know, because I don't know what, what the mindset is. Um, mine has changed, and I don't remember what mine used to be. But coming to Africa wasn't, wasn't an option, obviously. wasn't doing that. But, but, you know, I started coming to Africa. And when coming here, you see so many Europeans, yes. you know, especially, you know, from the UK, so many European Germans. Yes. They're down here, you know, they, they you know they make their, Euro, their Euros, they they do okay, but a lot of them see the opportunities and they seize on them. They yes. come down here and they buy the property, they start the businesses, they, they work together and they and they figure it out. And there's, I'm sure there's somebody, maybe just like you know, us, that's saying, hey, do this, do this, go here, talk to these people. You know, and you know they know it's some work on the you know that they have to do, right. but they got somebody on the ground giving them some some levels of guidance. Something's going on while these Europeans are coming down to South Africa. Right. Obviously, the weather's always most it's great most of the time. It rained earlier today. Um, you know, the food is good. You know, 
know, the the the, the, the people, people are, are the awesome. people are the best. Yes. Yeah. So I, I don't know, like you said, what's holding us back, but I know the Europeans are not being held back. No, they're they're here by the plane yeah. and boat. Plane <laughs> yeah, as fast yeah. they can get everywhere. Yeah. You know, I think they're changing the color spectrum. Yeah. You know, and it's like, but it's all good. It's all good. I mean, anybody that takes advantage of an opportunity, yeah, I have no problem with I that. can't fault them. Can't fault them. You know, it's like I just look at my brothers and sisters and say, come on, wake up. Get yeah. in the game. You know, it's one thing to talk about the game, but you can't score until you get in the game. Yeah. You know, you got to get off the bench. You got to get off the sideline. You got to get in and, you know, take some advantages because there are of here. Well, you got in. I mean, you got you, you got in the game. <laughs> oh yeah, this is not the only game I'm gonna get in. Either. But you know, and then it, and it goes back, you know, to what I've said before, and I may have mentioned it in a few other videos. You know, you got to come here on a trip. You guys, did, you literally just came on a trip, and you know, yeah, you saw some videos, but you, you know, probably didn't really know what to expect. You know, okay, we can we can go, and you came on a trip like I did many years ago. And you saw it, and you was like, you know, so it starts there. So I'm not going to say, well, I am going to say it. Like, where you guys are, you can't just start tomorrow. You know, you're, you're sitting in, you know, Calabasas, but not Calabasas. There's somewhere really nice. Mm -hmm. and, and then say, okay, I just want to go do what they do. Let me make a quick phone call. No, it, t it takes some some thought. Y'all thought about a lot of stuff. Oh, yeah. You had to sell houses. You had to leave yeah. family behind. You had to do a lot of things. So it's a lot of planning that right. goes in it, but that's, it helps when you're on a trip and right. you're here. Right. You know, eat a nice little, some ribs or something, yeah. you know, <laughs> it just helps. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, okay. So again, I always tell people to, to come on a trip there, they're vouching. Mm -hmm. um, that doesn't mean that you got a plan to, to live here. Right. I'm going to be honest with you. Most people who come on trips have no plans of living here at all. And then over a short period of time, a couple days, three days. Yeah, you, Jack, you know what I'm talking about. I don't want to leave. Yeah, you're like, nah. Yeah. Well, the, the couple that was here when we were here before, there was one couple that was they were thinking about moving here. There was another couple that just vacationed. Yeah. And they said, well, we, we, by the time it was time for them to leave, they said, we're moving here. And yeah. I believe they're back here now. Yeah, they're, they're, yeah, people come back, and it's good because, you know, we love assisting people, you know, that, that, that come here, they come with us, you know, we, we know their story, we, we will work with them, and then if they come back on their own and do their thing, that's fine. You know, if something goes wrong, sideways, give, me, you know, give us a shout and we will we will make things, you know, do what we can do. Um, but like I said, some people, they hit all the trees and they, they do all the stuff and then they're stuck in a, in a situation and then they're calling and I'm like, there's not much that we can, we can do because I, I make sure that... You know the bumpers are. You know when, when, you, when you come, so you yeah. you can succeed. So it's a cool. Well, yeah. all I'm going to say is, is congratulations. Of course, I mean this is this is a big deal. Yes, it's a big it is. deal, y'all. And um, you know we, we hopefully we you guys will give us a little bit of access to the chronicle what's going on yeah. here, yeah. and um, and people are, people are going to want to know. Well, a lot know. of people on your channel want to you know they want to follow along. <laughs> Yeah. Deal. So I'm like, it ain't up to me that much tomorrow. <laughs> ah, well, it ain't up to me, it's, it's other art. <laughs> well, you have our permission. Yeah. Well. She's going to be here every day. Yeah. You know, she's already going to be here every day. I mm -hmm. mean, every day. <laughs> okay? Okay. So, uh, you know what you can do? What's that? Because, you know, the clubhouse still delivers. And this is a stand. Oh. This is a stand. <laughs> So all you gotta do is call the clubhouse, and they will deliver it right here. Okay. They, they, they will the deliver. Plan. They'll say, "I'm right here," and they will bring you whatever. <laughs> nice cup of table. Yeah, nice plate, and you can just do that. See, that's how, that. Those are the types of things that happen here in in South Africa. It just does. So, all right, guys. Well, we totally appreciate it. We're gonna go walk the acre or so, and uh, we will see you guys later on here in sunny South Africa. visit beautiful Cape Town. Be a tourist in the city of gold, Johannesburg. Enjoy the warm water of the Indian Ocean in Durban. Interact with wildlife on a private game reserve. Luxury five-star hotels. 
and of course, world-class spas. Contact The Real South Africa today for your African adventure. Thanks so much for spending time with us today. If you like what you saw, please subscribe and don't forget to hit the notifications button so you don't miss out on all things The Real South Africa. Thanks again.